Grand season kicks off. Well, I think the kids are feeling the stress too. But if you think one teenager doing exams is tough, well, spare a thought for families with twins like the four sets at Good Samaritan Catholic College in Sydney's West. Just like 220,000 other Year 12 students around the country, 17-year-old Hannah Brocklehurst is in the midst of her final exams. Sometimes we work together to quiz each other and to practice, but yeah, so we're good study buddies. <laughs> Hannah has a lot in common with her study partner Gemma. Same subjects, same class schedule, they even share a birthday. Having twins is definitely double trouble. I know they want to do the best that they possibly can, but I know that they stress for each other. For staff and students at Good Samaritan, the Brocklehurst twins aren't a novelty. They're not even the only twins in Year 12. The full roll call includes Hannah and Gemma, Max and Diego, Peter and Paul, and Michael and Mark. They work really closely together. Um, they study together. They check off what one another are doing. They can be quite competitive with one another as well. I'd say in some subjects we're more competitive than others. If he doesn't have some notes here, I'll, I'll lend them, but... That's about it. I tend to try and give him the bad notes. I want to try and beat him. <laughs> no. I thought you said you weren't competitive. I said not that you know of. Oh. Despite the similarities, <laughs> the four pairs approach their exams in very different ways. I've got more of a, uh, I need to go well approach, whereas he has a, uh, if it happens, it happens approach. I'm a bit of a stressed head, so she always comes when it so it's good. <laughs> yeah. I usually have to drag him to school, otherwise he won't show up. Yeah. <laughs> Gemma and 